dislodged a piece of metal that was on the road, like a boss. And uh, I just wanted to uh, talk to you guys today about motorcycle tyres. Uh, mainly just to explain what happened to my tyre the other day. Because I uh, just got back from a big group ride. And I pulled, well actually no, I didn't get back from a group ride. It was in the middle of a group ride. It was before we even started the ride. We all kind of met up and uh, stopped at the bottom of this awesome mountain we were going to climb up together. And we kind of pulled up and no one was really checking anyone's tires. Like, they weren't checking anything for safety reasons. But they were checking just to see how far we've went over. Holy hell. Um, and one of them checked my tire and they noticed that uh, there was a screw just stuck in there. Like pretty hot, pretty heavy stuck in. I'll uh, put a picture of it right on the screen so you can see. But yeah, that's what it looked like and uh, it was stuck in my tire good. So that's what I noticed. And uh, then I'm like, wow, how am I going to climb this mountain and then ride all the way home with a screw in my tire? That's pretty dangerous. So I thought, you know, maybe I shouldn't be going on this ride. But by that time I was so pumped up and ready to ride, I just I wanted to get out of there, right? like I couldn't wait. So I went to the nearest gas station, which was just around the corner. I checked my tire pressure and it was still the same as it was in the morning. And it was still the same as it was last week. So it was, hasn't gone down any pressures. And my other mate suggested that it, it should be fine because if it's been in there that long, it's not going to come out now. It's pretty wedged in there, like high call. So I decided to go up the mountain and see what happens when I get to the top. So I go to the top and uh, it was still in there. So I'm like, awesome, well, nothing's wrong happening there. But, um, ah, oh, this is my mate Phil that I've been riding with. Very cool kid. Hello, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's your lane, brother. But, uh, yeah, so that's what happened, and then after that I got it home safely, and I didn't ride it for the rest of that week, because I was driving my car, and, you know, I just, I wanted to be safe, so I got a new tire put on, and now I have a Sport Demon, I think it's called, or a Street Demon tire on the back, so... I should be right now because I got a brand new tire and stuff. Only cost me uh, $185. That was including labor, including everything. The uh, tire by itself was only $125 or $140 something. So, pretty basic tire. God in hell. up this screw, but apparently it is. So, I don't know. Anyway, oh, 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 my box has been destroyed by bumps. Oh, that's so bumpy, it's not even funny. 